Okay. Well, uh, I did that uh, basic income proposal for Slovenia, and uh, in, uh, it was uh, uh, very much uh, uh, grounded on the Netherlands' ideas of basic income 30 years ago, because my professor, Dr. Velko Rus, he was a student in Netherlands. He brought the idea, he wrote the book in 1990s, and uh, I was, uh, I, I don't know how to say it, his student in a way. So uh, I believe that uh, uh, Slovenian proposal resembles that Netherlands proposal from the past. I'm not sure how it is today. Uh, maybe it's interesting that uh, uh, this professor, Rus, he proposed basic income to Dr. Kuchnik. Uh, at the time when Slovenia became uh, independent. He said that Slovenia is a really perfect country for that, because it's small and also it's very egalitarian, egalitarian uh, how to say it. We like equality because we didn't have any of our uh, aristocracy. And uh, also we are so small that we are so scared to do something to annoy our neighbors. Yeah. And we need basic income to give us like this free space to act like we want to without being scared that we are going to be ostracized by neighbors or uh, having a bad look or uh, even uh, having um, be forced to leave that, that uh, place we are staying. So we are, we are really, really sorry he didn't uh, succeed to do that. <laughs> and why do you think in Netherlands it will come earlier than here? Oh, yeah, well, because That's you... That's not logic. Because you were so very close in 70s, maybe with partial, but also because uh, Netherlands, I believe, is really very much forward in this post-industry industrial society. So uh, there, there is kind of a logical need to have basic income. If you don't have a lot of industry and so on, if you have a lot of uh, creative uh, practice and work, you need basic income. I don't know. I, I, I've been in Amsterdam, but I'm not <laughs> referring to that, but also in Tilburg or so on. Uh, I don't uh, think that uh, the, this uh, indu industrial um, kind of job or work uh, is working for, for the Netherlands in the uh, 21st century.